but we we just want to play the game naturally man we don't want this algorithm to know how many times we've done easter eggs how many kids we're gonna have are we gonna be able to continue our bloodline or not we just don't want to give that information out if you cannot sell call of duty points to the kids to the people to the masses they're not gonna help you out they're gonna ban you they're gonna throw you in another dimension they're gonna block you what's up toxic gamers today dr disrespect and nadia friend ended up getting caught with his pants down we're talking about zlander let's go for five likes on the video because i'm telling you we got a movie in the call of shame universe let's check it out later is a streamer that is completely protected by shanice she is part of an influencer relations team for <laughs> call of duty i still am not Man. sure if bro i really don't understand how call of shame acquires these videos but strong 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 men shouldn't have internet access so y'all agree men should be banned from the internet however mm -hmm. she claims to be responsible for flying these pathetic low iq warzone streamers to events she sends them cakes and lots of goodies in the mail Man. to keep them happy bro like this is actually wild because like Mo the the guy the guy that you just saw modern that was modern warzone doug doug nabid he always takes shots at the homie call of shame so i see what call of shame did the there, money bro. wasted on streamers is close to shocking damn money well, wasted guess what i have uncovered some evidence of a streamer chatting to zelaner about being shadow banned this banned streamer wants back on warzone so zelaner will speak to oh, Shanice shit. and have his shadow ban removed immediately bro playing, not yesterday day before Shanice, i'm, I'm playing. assuming and uh i was getting warmed up second game of the day i had 13 kills no, no spectators this time shoot at somebody disconnect shadow ban what then again today i'm playing today we're playing this tournament that we were playing earlier right and we're up by two there's only 10 pe or eight people left we're up by two and i'm shooting at a guy on this guy disconnected to shadow ban. damn no uh, i had I, I, I had two spectators that's damn son where'd you find this damn bro okay so now i'm expecting that he's gonna get activision strong independent shanice mm -mm. E -e -e -e. men are always wrong and i'm just so strong i'm strong i'm strong i'm strong i think he's gonna get her involved and gonna get him unbanned damn son carry on man i i can't like it blows my mind bro it's actually hurting my soul damn. i would check uh I, I, I'm gonna try to. F bro, you need to start praying, bro. Like, uh, if the, if getting banned in a game is hurting your soul, bro, like, I gotta say, I just gotta say a bruh yeah. for you, bro. Figure out someone you can hit up, but as of right now, I don't really have anyone off the top of my head other than. I mean, I could also hit, try to hit up Shanice for you as well, just to see if she'll answer, but. And then maybe, yeah. and then maybe point you in the right direction, but. That's good, because I don't think. That's what I ended up saying to her. Like, I, I was like, even if. Even if it's not like something that I don't know, it may not be her area or her space, but she could point me to the right person yeah. to talk to. Oh, wow. Exactly. Oh, wow. Exactly. And, 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 but I just didn't get a response. But then yeah. I, I messaged another guy, Bruh. actually a person that watched my stream, and she works for, uh, for Activision. But um, Damn. she said, message this person. It was a guy named Sean. And I messaged him, and again, like I was telling you earlier, no response either. No response on that either, huh? Yeah, Damn, that Sean huh? Ackerman was his name. In your community manager at Activision. Man, this is kind of deep, dog. Like, uh, so it's all about knowing who you know. It's all about that. It's definitely an amazing thing to have context. It's an amazing thing to know people and have a genuine, genuine relationship where they can help you out, you can help them out, and that's actually really, really beautiful, okay? Not denying that, but that's quite insane because if you get banned, because there has been so many people that have been commenting, so many people have been saying that, bro, I didn't even do anything, I just got banned for simply playing the game. They have been trying their absolute best to reach out. They have been sending them emails left and right, but they're strong and you're always wrong customer is always wrong if you are a call of duty player you're wrong wrong and i'm strong i'm not saying that me as a person is strong i'm just saying that they are strong activision they're strong independent you can try your best you can scream your lungs you can scream your tits off they're not gonna respond to you but if you are a streamer if you cheat if you're a cheater you use red pedals we're gonna help you out because we know you can sell the call of duty points to the kids if you cannot sell Call of Duty points to the kids, to the people, to the masses, they're not gonna help you out. They're gonna ban you, they're gonna throw you in another dimension, they're gonna block you, they're gonna call you toxic, they're gonna say, you're manipulating, you're starting drama. They're gonna label you as everything they possibly can under God's hot sun. Yeah, I'll definitely, uh, I'll definitely try to think of something, for sure. I'll try to, I'm sure there's someone that we can hit up. 
when I tried to get into an account, right? I tried to get into a game. Um, tried to get into a game that same night. Wouldn't let me into a game. And I j literally just now went, tried to get into a game on my new account or on, on my, my, my old account, my original account, right? Yeah. Get on that account Bruh. and I can't get into a lot. Like the lobbies only go up to like 80, 90 people. There's cheaters in them. Like it's just, it's a lot of shadow ban lobbies. That's actually weird. Dude, it's crazy, bro. So many people had issues with that, like on Warzone 1, too. That's just been, that's been Man, this skill based matchmaking lobby, I gotta tell you this, bro. Like so many problems. Activision, if you're listening, bro, okay? Man, as a, as a player, as a Call of Duty fan, a, a fan of years, okay? Years and years. I've been a fan of this franchise for years, dog. Get rid of skill-based matchmaking. It's seriously not helping, man. Like, the noobs are getting dunked on. They're getting stomped on by all of these streamers because they know how to reverse boost. The cat is out of the bag. You got two consoles, or even if you don't have any console, you just lower your stats. You s join somebody with lower stats, and that's it! You can reverse boost, you can use VPN and stuff like that. You can enter in the lobbies of players that you are trying to protect. And now they're having even more terrible time because if you keep the lobbies how they were back in the days with like maybe, because they always like to say that bro, Black Ops 2, even, even Black Ops 2 had skill-based matching. I mean, if it had skill-based matching, we did not notice it. We did not notice it, okay? Now we're noticing it because you opted. You opted like this. I'm still not saying that get rid of skill-based matchmaking completely. Bruh. Pop the brakes, okay? Pop the brakes. I'm saying keep skill-based matchmaking in rank play. Keep it there, okay? If somebody out there that loves uh, doing those puff puffs, uh, getting the Coco in and then play the game, they're gonna have rank play. They can do that Coco stuff and play that, okay? But for us, for normal people that doesn't do that Coco, let us play the normal game. Because either way, they, these streamers, people know how to get rid of skill-based matchmaking and join the lobbies. But we, we just want to play the game naturally, man. We don't want this algorithm to know how many times we've done Easter eggs, how many kids we're going to have. Are we going to be able to continue our bloodline or not? We just don't want to give that information out. We don't want to give that information out, okay? You you understand? Smash the like button if you understand, guys. Yeah, that's like, uh, yeah, that's been a thing forever. You know what's really weird? I've literally never, even with Warzone One, never dealt with a single shadow man. Me weird. either. Damn. Me either. Till this, this was the first time ever. First yeah, now, time now ever, I probably jinxed that. Of... Probably jinxed that kid for sure. But yeah, nah. first time, huh? For first. <laughs> there are people first that time. don't have first that, time. that were. That's for sure. Yeah, I agree. That's what I agree. I feel like people are on white list, bro. Yeah, probably. But, like, but I mean, think about it. Like, think about like, like the people, like Tim or Nick or Swag or Sim or us or whatever, right? They, they, even, even they have these massive followings. And like, when they get, they, 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 I, there's 100% time that they get, you know, spam reported. Yeah. Mm. But like, there's I, like, how does it not happen? Yeah, no, I totally, I totally believe it. It's I definitely totally possible, believe it. no doubt about it. If there's a shadow list, if there's a shadow ban list, there's definitely can be a, a white well, list. I'm a sheep. I believe everything you say. I'm gonna be a yes man because I'm strong, I'm independent. So I just don't believe in what, like, and I know you're not implying this by any means, but I, I just don't believe in the weirdos that think that it means like easier lobbies. I just think it means- Hey, stop the cap. Stop the cap, stop the cap. White listed as in like, you're gonna be, you're, you're like not you're gonna certified. have to deal you're not gonna have to deal with like getting disconnected Verified. from being, yeah, from being, from glitch, from like hacking it because they've already checked your stuff out. You know yeah. what I mean? Uh, to be honest, uh, he does have a point. Uh, in a way, okay, slightly, okay. I was just joking around with that stuff. He does have a slight point, just a little bit, okay, just a little bit. During my research, I found they were all patting each other on the back during something called the Community Manager Appreciation Day, and yes, that's a real thing. Thanks to this, I was able to find a whole bunch of these community managers for Call of Duty. I tried to reach out to them, but I was already blocked. Oh, by the way, after my video went live yesterday, Bobby Poth went into hiding. <laughs> what? What? Astaghfirullah. Astaghfirullah. Bobby, Bobby, this guy? You're talking about this man? Who went bozo at Activision? Bread. Here. Ladies and gentlemen, click on this video on the screen because Nadia, she went crazy! Or click the video on the left if you're into horror and UFO content. That's on my second channel. Check these videos out, guys, and I will see you right there.